What's up everybody, it's Nerd35 here bringing you guys a new video and in today's video I'm going to be getting the Platinum Trophy in uh, Assassin's Creed Brotherhood so without further ado, let's get into it and do that age-old thing of where you throw a coin in a well and make a wish, you know? Let's see here. Oh, I wish, I wish for a platinum trophy. Ooh! Yo! Your wish is great. Julius Caesar? Hey, look at that. My wish came true. Uh, big ups. I got a platinum trophy. <laughs> nice. Well, there it is. Julius Caesar win every trophy. I finally got it. Uh, what can I say about Assassin's Creed Brotherhood? Well, uh, overall, I enjoyed playing this game a lot more than I did AC3. This game wasn't as annoying or troublesome to play overall, and I had a, like a much more enjoyable time playing through this game and getting the trophies in it. Although not everything was perfect though. So some of the requirements for the full 100% sync, because this is another game that requires like the full 100% sync to get everything in it, but the requirements for it in this game, or for some of the missions in this were all kind of annoying, but they were nowhere near as bad as they were in Assassin's Creed 3, mind you. Thank God for that. <laughs> the, these were a little bit more reasonable, and, and so, but some of them were kind of a problem, like some of the Da Vinci machine missions, like the one where you're in this flying machine, the, the requirement for that one was took a few tries, was kind of annoying. But, um, you know, like I said, at least they weren't as bad as they were in the 3. But, um, I really like the gameplay in this game, too. Like, see, while I was playing uh, this game and even Assassin's Creed 3 to a degree, I really uh, realized just how much I really enjoyed the uh, combat of these earlier Assassin's Creed games. 
like the way the combat plays out and the way it feels is just really enjoyable especially uh in brotherhood i really like the like fighting enemies with the type of combat that they have for this that's another reason why i'm not that into the newer uh, ac games i don't really like how the new combat system looks in those games uh, the soundtrack in this game is, is really nice too. I enjoy listening to a lot of the music that played in the game while uh, playing it. This game, honestly, this game has a uh, beautiful soundtrack, and uh, the multiplayer took me a while to do too. Like I didn't, I didn't really play this game's multiplayer when it was new, so I really only like experiences the what was in this game through the uh, uh, through like the different. Uh, boost that I did to get the online trophies. It seems like the multiplayer this was pretty good to play if you know if you played it more naturally. But that um this this trophy right here, this Abstergo Employee of the Month uh, trophy, was by far the most annoying trophy to get. Like it didn't even want to unlock the first time I did it. I, I did the requirements for it on like two s different separate occasions. And two different boosting sessions that I did for this game before this trophy would finally pop. And you can tell by the uh, trophy dates, you know, uh, it, it took me a lot while to get this trophy compared to, like, the other uh, multiplayer trophies. Hey, how long it took. It, you can look up the, if you want to, you can look up the requirements needed for Abstoker Employee of the Month. Yeah, the, trying to get this trophy in and of itself is a whole process. Now, however, what with this being a, a Ubisoft game and an Assassin's Creed game, not everything turned out right. So, as you can see here, um, I didn't, I didn't manage to get these last few trophies, and um, I have no idea what happened. Like the requirements for these trophies aren't even hard, like this one right here, or these, or anything. But uh, for some reason, I and I tried s uh, several different times. And the trophies, these last couple trophies, like these two right here, just wouldn't um, unlock for me uh, for whatever reason. So then I decided to look it up. And apparently it's a pretty common issue with this game in that the trophies will just randomly like stop unlocking for whatever reason. I don't know why. It's just a problem that exists in this game. So after that, I went to go look up the solutions that I found to try to, to fix it. So, you know, I uninstalled the game. That I un uninstalled the game data, essentially uninstalling the game off the PlayStation, rebooted the game, declined the game update, re let the game reinstall, quit out of the game, apply, go back into the game and apply the update this time. Then play, then tried to play the game again to see if the trophies were unlocked. And that didn't work. And then I tried you know, a couple of days later. I tried again, where like I you know, uninstalled the. Where this time I backed up my save and profile data. Then I deleted that. Then I deleted the game again and repeated that whole process a second time to try to get the trophies to pop up. And I did the requirements again, and they still didn't pop. Like for this one, I, I even looked up a guide how to do it. I stole, I stole the horses on horseback without um without ever touching the ground because apparently that's how you're supposed to get it but uh, i must i must have like stolen like 30 horses like that at, at this point and i still never got the trophy and same with this i lost count how many how many times i paid the florence to the guy and stolen back and the trophy never popped so these just won't unlock for some reason now and it really sucks too because like outside of the, this last couple of miscellaneous things all i really had left was just the fan off 100 percenting the game like i had to finish the rest of the dlc and then get the 100 percent saying that's all, that's all i had left it was just to, to do that and then um but after those failed attempts and then i attempted to try to unlock the, the trophies uh one more time before i finished you know before i filmed this video and the and after all that i think i've finally come to a conclusion I'm gonna have to pretty much uh I'm gonna have to pretty much start this game over again from scratch and re 100% everything in order to get like the 100% uh get get this trophy right here. So I'm gonna have to like restart the game all over again in order to do that. And uh, I really don't feel like doing that right now. <laughs> this. This isn't like an extremely long game or anything like that. I feel like this game was a bit shorter to do than um, Assassin's Creed 3, but that's still quite a lot of stuff I have to do again. I really don't feel like doing that all over again right now. So I just decided to go ahead and um, get the platinum in it, and then I'll just put it away for now and just come back to it later on in a later day and just start over again and just re-100% everything. 
And it's weird how that glitch even happens because, like I said, that high roller one was the last one I was able to get, and the others wouldn't work. Yet the the um the uh, trophy for throwing some uh, money in a well to make a wish. Yeah, this trophy right here for throwing money in a well, I was able to unlock that. As you can see, I unlocked it when I got the platinum, despite the fact that you know all the other ones I, ha I wasn't able to get. So. I wasn't able to get any of the DLC related ones anymore for whatever reason, but I was able to get your wishes is granted for some reason, but I, I, I can't get like the DLC specific trophies. I, it's, I don't know. It's weird, man. Like I, 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 I honestly, I think I'm about done with Ubisoft at this point. <laughs> like, like even when I actually am enjoying playing this game, like I actually enjoy playing AC Brotherhood. This game was actually fun to play. And even when I was actually enjoying this, there's something still had to go wrong at the very end of it all. Like, it, it's like you're not allowed to enjoy games made by Ubisoft or something. Like, I don't know what it is. Like, you, you're just not meant to enjoy them or whatever. Like, stuff like this is, makes it hard for me to want to play games made by them, to be honest with you. But uh, enough about that. I don't want this to go on for too long. But, um, yeah, I, I don't know. I, I, I'm about done with Ubisoft at this point. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I'm Step Mac 35 and I'm out. Please don't forget to be writing, comment, and subscribe. Peace. Mom. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Call for your mama.